Hi, this is Florida Trailblazer. I'm exploring an Andrews Wildlife Management Area. Enjoying this beautiful wilderness and seeing what history I can discover along the way. In the 1800s, this area by the Suwannee River became an important navigation route. Steamboats carried lumber to Cedar Key for transport by steamship to Europe and the Northeast. Much of the virgin cypress in the Suwannee floodplain was harvested in the early 1900s. In the early part of the 1900s, what was later to become Andrews was subject to a wide range of uses, including open range livestock grazing. In 1945, the Andrews family purchased the area. They managed the land for outdoor recreation and were careful to protect its natural resources. Limited weekend hunts were held for deer, turkey, and squirrel. In 1985, the state purchased this land and today is used for recreational purposes. Here in the woods along the Suwannee River is this abandoned cabin. The cabins here may have been built by the Andrews family and used for hunting and recreational purposes during the mid to later 1900s. Been here for a long time. And not much remains inside. Just the structure itself still standing. Okay, here is a small cabin, still standing here in the woods. Just got this one room and a bathroom over here. See there's once power going to the cabin. In this area of the woods was a cabin and some structures. Most of it is gone now. You see a lot of debris laying around. There's a structure here.
There's a small wooden structure still standing here at the site. Remains of another structure over in this area. 